Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Live from Total Value RV right here at Elkhart, Indiana, the RV capital of the world. Guys, this is one of the newest products we got in. It is a 2021 29J Thor Outlaw. It's the Outlaw because it can just do everything. Okay, so let's take a look at it. First here, you got your fiberglass cap here in the front, which is the molded cap. You got your docking lights up there on the top then for you. It's on the E450 chassis. Even though it's a 21, it still has the V10 power in it. You have your side mirrors right here, which will extend out for you to get past. Another nice thing they have is right here is you have your side cameras. So that way when you turn your turn signal on, it's gonna come down and show you down this side of the coach or on the other side then as well too. You also see here for three months, you have a free trial to the Sirius XM. Another nice thing, I would like to make an announcement for you. New, just announced today from Thor, and applies to this as well, okay? On the Thor products now, you have the one-year bumper-to-bumper warranty. Your three years, 36,000 miles from Ford. But what Thor has done for you, which is exciting, folks, okay? A 12-year structure warranty and a six-year delamination warranty. It's pretty impressive best in the industry and they just came out with it today so you are the first ones to hear about it on our video okay so let's go on around there you can see you have your windshield with your windshield wipers there again we have our side camera right here for when you turn down to this side in this compartment right here you have your lp which you have 40 pounds of lp in there okay here you have your own 4000 watt generator that's locked but trust me your own 4,000 watt generator is in there. It'll run right off of your fuel line. So if you get below about an eighth of a tank, it's not gonna allow you to run your generator so you don't run yourself out of fuel. And then that will also power everything in the coach for you, okay? When we come on here, this is the back of your refrigerator. Again, this is locked. Let me grab, let me grab the keys. Okay, again, you have your own in 4,000 watt generator right here. I went ahead and unlocked it so we can show it to you so you wouldn't think I was fibbing to you. That'll run right off your fuel line, get below about an eighth of a tank. It's not gonna allow you to run your generator anymore. But when you have that running, it'll run everything on the inside of the coach. So if you're dry camping or whatever it may be at the Walmart, you can just park there and then run everything. Then this compartment, there's your tank right there. You can also see right here, this is for your dumps here. You got your waste holding tank right here and the sewer connection here. You got 40 gallons of fresh, 30 gallons of gray and 34 and, or I'm sorry, 30 gallons of black and 34 and a half gallons of gray. 2021, you have the tankless hot water heater. Okay, so you don't have to worry about running out of hot water. Just go ahead and shower away. And then you're right there. Here's your outside shower. You should have the hot and the cold on there for you. This is your black water flush. What that'll do for you is you hook your water hose up to that, open your black water tank, and you got little sprayers in there. So that way you don't get any false readings from the black water tank, okay? Here's where you have your 30 amp power cord connection. You can see it's all marine grade sealed. Don't have to worry about the bugs going up in there and following it in. So you got 30 amp service. Here you have your connection for cable if the park offers it. This here is your city water connection right here, okay? This is where you fill. Here's where you have the place to store your sewer hose. Okay, then right here, we have some storage right there. You can see you've got a thousand entertainment, a thousand watt entertainment inverter. So what that means is that will run your TV for you, which you can run right off of your batteries. So if you got quiet time or whatever it may be, here's where you have your vent for your garages on the inside and the outlaw. Okay, you come back here, you've got a manual awning for the back here you got your docking lights right there back here you have an 8,000 pound hitch with your seven-way plug okay so what you got here is then you want to take the toys with you when you go right so we just open this up mr. cameraman's helped me on that side and then this just comes down see it's got a little cord right here Okay, now you have this here. Now when you're loading up your bikes or whatever it may be, you can just unhook these right here, okay? And then this will drop all the way down for you. Then otherwise, what you can use when you get to your destination is you can have yourself a little patio area. So then this will just come out here. It snaps down here. 
Yeah. You there? You got one there? Yes, sir. And one there. And this will fold out here for you. See little wheels there for you. And you've got it on the other side there, too, where Mr. Caberman is. It's just that little snap right there. Pull that out. And what you do, have this come out here. Whoop, we'll go this way. See, now, you get in there, got a little patio deck here. You kind of hang out there. If you get close enough to the lake, you have your own little dock right here. Now, on the patio itself, it can hold up to 1,500 pounds. In your garage area, which you can put your bike, your motorcycle, your golf cart, four-wheeler, whatever it may be, but you've got 1,000 pounds of carrying capacity in the garage itself. Okay. You can also see what Thor does for you on the Outlaws. you got your frameless windows. It's going to do two things for you. Number one, it's going to cover your seals here so, so it protects your seals so they don't discolor. You can also open up these windows out this way. So if it's raining or whatever it may be, you can still get an airflow in there, okay? And right here, you have your LP Quick Connect. So you can cook your grill right up to that from the LP on the other side. Here you have some more storage, all lined in the ABS, so it's gonna be real easy for you to clean out. Here you have your power patio awning. You can see it's a 16 foot awning, which will come out here, so that way it'll protect you from the sun, whatever it may be. You get done the day riding a bike, Going out and seeing this great country of ours. Now you have your outside entertainment with your sound bar right in there. It's Bluetooth capable as well, too, so you can play your music right off of that. Okay, so you can just sit out here underneath your patio awning and boom, enjoy the day. Oh, another nice thing Mr. Cameraman is pointing out is this TV will come out and swivel. So you can move it wherever, okay? And then just goes right back in there. Okay, then here you have some outside plugs right here for you. Here's your gravity fill for your fresh water right here. And then right here, you have some more storage right there. Okay. So we've looked around the outside. Would you guys be interested in seeing inside? Mr. Cameraman's very excited. Okay. So we open up the door here. Now right here in this little compartment, see this little latch right here? There's where your house batteries are. Okay. Now the nice, nice thing when you come in here, the Outlaw itself is prepped for the solar already, okay? So you've got your solar prep right there. So all you got to do is find out where it mounts on the roof, and you can mount it up there, and then you can run your 100-watt solar right off the top. So that way you can trickle charge your batteries, or if you want to get out in a boondock, stay out and about, you can do that there. You can run just about everything. So you can't run your air. Uh, you can't run your microwave. You can basically just run your lights, your refrigerator, and things of that nature off of the solar, okay? Here's your battery disconnect right here when you're not using it this is for your inverter this is for your awning put it in and out right here okay and you got your little step light right here and then you got your interior light switches right here okay so come on in you can see we've got the slides in okay so even with the slides in we can see everything we can get to everything okay we can get to our kitchen get to our refrigerator we can get to the bathroom and get to the back garage back here so you can get to everything even with the slide in okay so what we do we come back here to our control center here at the control center you can see what you have here's where you can start your generator start and stop it right here here's where you can tell your levels for everything your lp your battery your fresh water your black water your gray water all right there on your monitor panel then right here the exciting part of the program is we're going to have the slide out session Okay, so you can see where it says retract and extend. So I just want to hit extend. And then the slide itself will begin to go out. We used to break away to the grass growing channel, but it uh, went away from low ratings. I found it hard to believe. The Kentucky Bluegrass Special was always good. And there's opportunity calling, so we'll call them back. Okay, so now we got the slide all the way out. One thing right here in the control panels as well, too, what you have here, you'll see right here it says tank heaters. You got your black and your gray. So you just flip that on, and then you got heating pads on the bottom of your holding tanks. That way they don't freeze up for you. Turn your water pump on if you're dry camping. This is a control for your air conditioner right here, and this has the automatic leveling on it, too. So where you just hit a button, hit auto level, and then it'll automatically level the coach for you. Okay? So now we've got the slide out. See how much more room? 
we've got now okay you can see here you got your driver and passenger seat and your ford f450 normal chassis nice thing i wanted to show you which is a total value rv exclusive look at that right there mr cameraman can you show them that when you're out shopping around for your 2021 29j outlaw ask the salesperson hey i would like to see the one with 70.9 miles on it after probably a couple moments of awkward silence, he might say, uh, let me call the manager. Well, let me tell you, you don't have to call the manager, just call us, because it's a total value RV exclusive. Why is that important? You're gonna be the first person to put the first critical miles on this coach, not somebody who gets paid to get from here, where they're built, Elkhart, Indiana, to wherever they're trying to sell it to you. Just buy them here, where they're built. Makes sense, right? Okay. So there, remember I told you about the um, backup camera and the side cameras? Right there, you have your stereo, but you also, that's where your backup camera and your monitoring system would be. You got your air conditioner controls, your heater controls, your cup holder right there. The driver and the passenger seat will both swivel around and make part of the living area for you. Another nice thing I want you to notice, look at the small transition from the cab to the body, okay? Normally you'll see a real high step. There you can see you don't have that, okay? So it's an easier transition for you. Up here, this is a nice thing too. What's this for? Say you need to sit a little bit higher on your seats or you just want to be a little bit more comfortable at the end of the day when you got this swiveled around, set these on your seat and that'll work for you. So you can see up here, <clears throat> excuse me, we've got our uh, bunk up here. You got your window right there and you have your entertainment system here which is on a swivel arm, so it'll come out here so that way you can see it out here. Right here you have the fantastic fan, so you can just turn that on, open up the windows, and that'll help circulate the air all throughout the coach for you. Okay, so in the outlaw, what we have? We have a couch right here for this side right here, and then you have a couch right here. So you have seat belts there, seat belt there, seat belt there, seat belt there, and there. So you can seat belt one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, this will make into a bed for you right here. Okay, this one here is a small little scissor couch. So it'll make into a small bed for you right there. Okay, and remember I was telling you about the um, frameless windows and how they open up. You can see right, right here, you just crack those open and then that way you have some airflow for you. Okay, then all the way throughout we have our shades all the way through, okay. Then right here, let's take a look at the storage. You got some storage right here, all with the hidden hinges for you. Okay. There's your controls for your cable right there. Okay. Here you have two LED lights right here. Okay. You got them both there. Over here we have some more storage. Here and here and here. And that's pretty deep all the way back in there. It's all the way to my elbow. Okay. So... Here in the slide system, this is what slides out right here. You got your couch and then your refrigerator that slides out. This is a gas electric refrigerator. So it'll run off of the gas, it'll run off of the electric. You can also set the temperature on there for you. And there you can see you got your freezer. That's your bag with all your books in it. In case you didn't have enough TV, we had the TV outside. You got the TV right there. Say you got kids that are squabbling. I don't want to watch that. I want to watch something else. Okay. You can turn the show on there. We got another one here. Okay. So we do not want you to go without TV. So then down here, you have a nice little drawer. Here you got your kitchen area. Right here, which you have your countertop extension. Right there. Okay. And then you got your nice, big, deep farmer sink that's stainless steel. Going to make it very easy to clean for you. Okay. High rise faucet with the pull out sprayer. Here, right here, get rid of the damn problem, right? So what are they talking about? See this here, how these folks do this here? And your roof here, it's just gonna collect water. See how you have those screws right there? And it doesn't go and wrap under. See how it's wrapped under here on the Thor motor coach? So what's that gonna do for you? It's gonna allow for the water to run off for you. And then you're not gonna get the water set up right there. Okay, we're gonna tell Opportunity we can't talk right now and we'll call them back. Okay, we're gonna have some more storage right here. Some storage right there. Place to put your cleaning supplies right there. Storage there. Okay. We do have a pots and pans drawer there. Look how they kind of made it look like the oven. So it's a nice clean look. Oh, 
and there's not an oven. So there's two drawers. Looks like an oven, but you got two drawers. Okay. And then you got your three burner cooktop right there. Your microwave right here. Okay, it's got the speed cook, so it's a convection microwave. So it'll bake just like your regular oven. Just hanging space there. Hanging space here. Storage there. Storage there. Storage there. And storage there. Okay. There's your fuse box right there. And then your breaker box. And then you got your bathroom right here. Okay. So you got your stool right here, which is a porcelain stool. You got your shower with the skylight right there. Whoop. Yeah, it's a little warm today, guys. So, you can see you got plenty of room right there. Okay, right here, you got your medicine cabinet. Stainless steel sink right here. Here's for your control for that tankless hot water heater here where you can set the temperature right here. A couple plug-ins right there. Nice little countertop here. Place to store some stuff there. And some more storage there. Okay. Also, on the coach, if you look up there, Mr. Cameron, we have a 13.5 air conditioner up here, which does have the quick cool. I wish we had on right now, which I would open that up and the air would dump right out of here. And then when I shut it, it'll go back through the vents for you. Okay. So now we've seen everything up here. You saw the little control panel. <clears throat> Come on in here. Here's your garage. Okay. So you got your little garage right here. A little toolbox right there. Put some stuff. Say one of you guys say you got three kids with you. None of them want to watch the same thing. Well, you can put one there, one there, and then one here, one outside. So we can watch four different things. Okay, you might say, hey, this seems a little low. Well, okay, it is, but let's tell you why here in just a second. Some more storage there, some more storage there. Okay, nice little shelf right here. A 5,000 BTU air conditioner for the garage area. The garage area also has its own stereo system that you can listen to right here. And then this here is for charging. So you can jump your uh, motorcycle or whatever it may be. Got your plug-ins right here, turn your lights on right there. Okay, and you might say, hey, what's this right here? Well, let's take a look. We got this little button here, right here, Mr. Cameraman. So, you might need just a little bit more sleeping, right? So now, this is up out of the way, we're not using it. And at night, when you're getting ready to go to bed, everybody's getting ready to take a little nap. Boom. Now, we've got another little bed right here, okay? got cup holders right there for you a little place to store stuff right here okay and it's a nice mattress too it's a nice little memory foam mattress and it's got an outside table right there thank you mr cameraman then when you don't want to use it you just push the button here and it goes back up okay then you see right there there's your vents right there for you so that we can get some airflow throughout it which you can open mr cameraman showing you right there Okay. So now we've got it all up. It's 29J Outlaw. I don't know what you think. Hopefully you like it. There you can see you got tie downs right there for you as well. Okay. And then we're out on our patio right there. See, so we're out here. This is a great way to see this country of ours. Just come out here and just kind of hang out after the day. See what's going on. Talk to your neighbors. Talk to someone. Say hello. That's what it's all about. RVing. Okay? So you might say, hey, Mr. Cameraman, Mr. RV Whisperer, how do I get a hold of you? Well, we have a phone. You can call us at 866-282-4460. Or you can visit us on the web at TotalValueRV.com. If you see something here we might have missed, or if you want to find out a little bit more, just email us, let us know, we can go over it again. Or if there's anything else you'd like to see us do a walk around for, we'd be more than happy to do that for you. Okay, so you can also, if you get in your car, they've let us out, we're open. They've said, hey, it's okay, come on out. So you can get on the toll road, get on 8090, get off at exit 92, take a right, go to the next light, take another right. Come down here, go through the four-way stop, and take a right. And you can show them, Mr. Cameraman, there's our part of our beautiful driveway right there. You can also see we have camping spots, so after you get your coach, you're more than welcome to come here, stay the night, play with it, try it out, see if everything works, we missed anything, whatever it may be. Plus, there's a lot of great stuff to see here. We're very close to Lake Michigan. we got Shipshawana close by. And we have a saying here, it says, come in as strangers and leave as friends. If you're still here, thanks for watching.
I wonder who checked this in. Just in case you people out there want to know, Mr. Cameraman's responsible for checking this stuff in. And, uh, yeah, he's supposed to unlock stuff. And as you can see, it's not that. breaking news alert. 